Time now for a look inside a prestigious home that was in dire need of a spruce up. Government House in Wellington has officially reopened after work costing tens of millions of dollars. Aaron Soma has our guided tour. It gives me great pleasure to unveil the plaque. Drawing the curtains, Governor-General Sir Anand Satyanand officially reopening Wellington's Government House. Built in 1910, the cracks were starting to show. The roof uh, needed replacing, tiles flew off in uh, high winds. The restoration project began in August 2008. The budget nearly $50 million, but that was later slashed. The heritage building's been earthquake strengthened, had power, gas and water services replaced, and there's improved privacy for the Governor General, his apartment behind these doors. Much of the decor also restored to its original glory. If we knew what it looked like, we would try and match the original. We wouldn't try and fake it. And it's been adapted for a modern day Governor General. Reconstructing the roads that were you know, built in the days of horse and carriages. We loved the old house because we thought it was comfortable and elegant, but now it's smart and elegant. The first official guest to the newly conserved government house was Prince William on his visit to New Zealand last week, so here's a sneak peek at the suite he stayed in. It's one of the eight guest suites in the house. He's a marvellous uh, guest to have. Open days at Government House will be held in early April. Aaron Soma, One News.